Water is a limited resource that society no longer has the luxury of wasting. Landscape practitioners can lead conservation efforts and sustain water supplies for future generations by pursuing the goal of no potable water use in the landscape. Projects are more likely to reach this goal if it is established early in the design process and supported by all team members. It can be accomplished through soil stewardship practices that protect and restore soil health, the careful selection and maintenance of vegetation that is well suited to site conditions, and stringent water conservation. Potable water use in the landscape can also be safely replaced with alternative on-site water resources that are often wasted, such as stormwater runoff, harvested rainwater, air conditioner condensate, and gray water. A water balance analysis or water budget that estimates a site's water requirements as well as the amount of water available from precipitation and alternative on-site resources should be conducted early in the project and used to guide design decisions. Such an analysis is useful when determining the size of irrigated areas, appropriate plant types, and water catchment and storage requirements, and is critical for ultimately maintaining water demands within the on-site water availability. Design decisions should be constantly weighed throughout the development of the project and adjustments made to balance the site's water use with the available non-potable water resources. Site strategies to minimize potable water and recharge groundwater supplies include stormwater catchment and reuse, gray water catchment and reuse, reclaimed water reuse, air conditioner condensate catchment and reuse, drought resistant soils and vegetation, avoiding wasteful irrigation and maintenance practices. It is easy to overlook the need for judicious water use and monitoring when alternative water sources are being used. Oftentimes, alternative water sources are treated as extra water available for non-critical functions. Project teams and maintenance staff must understand that alternative water sources are as valuable as potable water and should be treated as such. Site monitoring and maintenance plans should include guidance on conservation strategies as well as on the proper monitoring and care of the alternative water systems.